a discussion about who are the leaders of permaculture led to Nicole Alderman making a poll with three different polling styles where anybody could nominate and anybody could vote. It was suggested that the results would be skewed because these people are the favorites of the permies.com community and might not appropriately reflect the greater permaculture community. So a fourth poll was created with the idea that the top people from the earlier polls would select who they think are the top leaders in permaculture. Out of 133 nominations, 46 were selected as the top. Of those that were alive, and we could find contact information, we asked them to rank the best leaders for permaculture for all time. For the 10 people selected by their peers as the best leaders in permaculture, we give each of them the 2021 permies.com Permaculture Leadership Maestro Award. And for six additional people, we give them the 2021 permies.com Permaculture Leadership People's Choice Award. Starting with the People's Choice Awards. Sean Dimbroski is the owner and operator of Edible Acres, a popular YouTube channel which doubles as a permaculture nursery and forest farm research space. He focuses on ways to grow food with human scale earthworking and low technology solutions. Alan Savory has spent his life researching and finding solutions for the desertification of the world's grasslands. His methodology, holistic management, provides a framework for managing the complexities of the living world while utilizing a grazing planning procedure that regenerates grasslands and can reverse desertification. His book, Holistic Management, A Common Sense Revolution to Restore Our Environment, describes his effort to find workable solutions ordinary people could implement to overcome many of the problems besetting communities and businesses today. Ben Falk is the author of the award-winning book, The Resilient Farm and Homestead. He developed Whole Systems Design as a land-based response to biological and cultural extinction and the increasing separation between people and elemental things. Life as a designer, builder, ecologist, tree tender, and backcountry traveler continually informs Ben's integrative approach to developing landscapes and buildings. Bryant Redhawk holds a PhD in microbiology and is best known for his soil science series on permies.com. These articles explain the importance of healthy soil microbiology to having a thriving garden ecosystem and give specific advice on how to apply this knowledge to your garden. He and his wife live on 15 plus acres in the woods where they continue their own research both in agriculture and soils with the hope to make the world more like it used to be before mankind began screwing up the earth mother. David Holmgren is an Australian environmental designer, ecological educator, and writer. He is best known as one of the co-originators of the permaculture concept with Bill Mollison. David is passionate about the philosophical, conceptual, and practical foundations for sustainability, and his book, Principles and Pathways, is regarded as a major landmark in permaculture literature. Joel Salatin calls himself a Christian, libertarian, environmentalist, capitalist, lunatic farmer. He is co-owner of Polyface Farms, which, producing meat he describes as beyond organic and are raised using environmentally responsible, ecologically beneficial, sustainable agriculture. He has been featured in news stories, books, conferences, and documentaries showcasing his regenerative agriculture through rotational grazing. And now for the Maestro Awards. 
Mark Shepard is the CEO of Restoration Agriculture Development, the Forest Agriculture Nursery, and runs New Forest Farms, a 110-acre perennial agricultural savanna, one of the first of its kind in the USA. He is the author of the award-winning Restoration Agriculture, Real-World Permaculture for Farmers, and Water for Any Farm. Brad Lancaster is an expert in the field of rainwater harvesting and water management. He is also a permaculture teacher, designer, consultant, co-founder of Desert Harvesters, and author of Rainwater Harvesting for Drylands and Beyond. Eric Toensmeyer is the award-winning author of many books, including Perennial Vegetables and The Carbon Farming Solution, and is the co-author of Edible Forest Gardens. He is an appointed lecturer at Yale University and has studied useful perennial plants and their roles in agroforestry systems for over two decades, and cultivates about 300 species in his urban garden. Rosemary Morrow is one of the pioneering women in permaculture. For almost 40 years, she has worked extensively with farmers, villagers, and refugees. She is known and appreciated for her pragmatic and effective approach to creating permaculture systems across a very broad range of environments, such as in Southeast Asia, the Middle East, India, and East Africa. She focuses on taking permaculture to communities who wouldn't normally have access to it, and how to meet needs with abundance for water and food security, and successful, sustainable farming models, no matter the situation. Toby Hemingway was an American author and educator who wrote extensively on permaculture and ecological issues. He was the author of Gaia's Garden and Permaculture City. Gaia's Garden is an affordable, accessible, informative introduction to permaculture and is usually the first book people read on the subject. Through his books, lectures, and magazine articles, he brought ecological design and sustainable culture to a large segment of society. Willie Smits is a forestry engineer, microbiologist, conservationist, animal activist, and social entrepreneur. For over 30 years, Smits has been working for reforestation and the conservation of endangered primate species, such as the orangutan. He is currently using sustainable agriculture, reforestation, and forest monitoring to reforest more than 500,000 acres of degraded tropical rainforest. Paul Wheaton. Okay, this is silly since I own permies.com and help facilitate these awards. Um, thanks to the permaculture leaders for giving me votes. Okay, let's go to the next one. Jeff Lawton is a permaculture farmer, filmmaker, designer, consultant, educator, and aid worker. For over 30 years, he has specialized in permaculture education, design, implementation, system establishment, administration, and community development. Lawton's aim is to establish self-replicating education demonstration communities, share project sites, and he has educated over 25,000 students in permaculture worldwide. Sepp Holzer is a farmer and author of several books who works nationally as a permaculture activist in the established agricultural industry and works internationally as advisor for ecological agriculture. He specializes in cold climate and desert permaculture, especially at high altitudes and steep slopes, utilizing hubuculture and earthworks to create productive land from that which was previously considered unfarmable. Bill Mollison is considered to be the father of permaculture. Mollison not only coined the term permaculture, he wrote the Permaculture Bible titled Permaculture, a designer's manual, 
and also founded the Permaculture Institute in Tasmania as a researcher, author, scientist, teacher, and biologist. He spent decades of his life devoted to understanding, teaching, and furthering permaculture around the world.